hi and welcome to my youtube channel so today i will show you that how you can use meta.ki to create your images to create the best images for your business needs or for your personal needs so without wasting your time let's get started So first of all, this is a complete case study based video and I will show you the best prompts that you can use to uh, create the best images from meta.ai. So if I open meta.ai from here, like you can see that meta.ai is here. This is the website of meta.ai. You have, if you have WhatsApp, then you can use meta on WhatsApp or Facebook, Instagram or on your messenger if you don't have the meta.ai on your whatsapp application then you can just keep updating your whatsapp and uh, it will appear on your whatsapp so now i will show you that how you can create the best image from this meta.ai if you give it a simple prompt uh, to create an image it will just create an ordinary image for you and you cannot use that image uh, for your uh, personal needs or for your business needs. So what you have to do is you'll have to so I will show you an example uh, This one is my image like you can see that I have given uh, a, a prompt a rocket launching from a laptop. So this was uh, my prompt I have given to this meta AI to create an image, okay? And then as you can see that this uh, chatbot has created this image. It's not that what I wanted. It's not that what I needed. Uh, it's not that up to up to the mark uh, image. As you can see that this is a very simple prompt a rocket launching from a laptop and I did not explain that what I needed and what angles I needed and all those things. And the second image and the second prompt I gave to Meta AI, like you can see that imagine a vibrant scene where a sleek rocket is launching dramatically from the screen of a laptop. The laptop screen should radiate with energy. And I have given all these details to this Meta AI to create an image. And the images are here, like you can see that this is what I wanted uh, this Meta AI to create. Like you can see that this is the best image I have got. The rocket is launching from the laptop and people are... Uh, people are excited like you can see that so this is the best image I have got from Meta AI like you can see that this is the good image I can use it for my personal needs I can use it for my business needs like you can see that this is very wonderful and aesthetic picture I have got from this Meta AI so the secret strategy is how can you write these prompts how can you write this prompt so i have used chat gpt to write these prompts okay so as you can see that this is a simple prompt that i have given here in this section uh, to uh, a, a rocket launching from a laptop here what i have written to chat gpt share a prompt for an ai chatbot i wanted to create an image of a rocket launching from a laptop okay so i have uh, just uh, given this prompt to chat GPT and chat GPT has given me this prompt and I have just copied this and I have just pasted it in this section uh, of the meta AI and the meta AI has created this these best yeah. pictures yeah. for me. So that's, so that's uh, how you can just uh, use chat GPT or you can just use meta AI or Gemini to create prompts for you as well. But in my opinion, uh, you need to uh, practice uh, writing prompts. You need to practice prompt engineering because only you know that what you need. Only you know what are your requirements. You can't just, uh, the chat GPT can't just explain all the requirements of you, of your business needs, of your personal needs. You just uh, need to write all the details by yourself to Meta AI or to Gemini or to any other AI chatbot to create images or to create some best conversations to, for your personal or business use. Now, the second question is how can you use these images? Can you use these images on any other social media platforms? Yes, you can use these images on social media platforms, uh, on uh, your website, on your e-commerce website or any other site, but you need to uh, you need to read the policy of the site. If the site has some uh, licensing factors, then you can just read uh, the 
terms and conditions of that site before using the AI generated pictures. So that's all for this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, then do it now so you won't miss my videos in future. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more.